tried to switch from, from looks to stamina, but this is a man who has called women pigs, slobs, and dogs, and someone who has said pregnancy is an inconvenience to employers, who has said, said women don't deserve equal pay unless they do as good a job as Didn't men. Say. Hillary, in that debate, at that, with, that, with what you just heard her said, went on to bring up this Elena Machado, who was a Miss Universe uh, several, many, many years ago, uh, 20 years ago or so. And uh, this woman accuses Donald Trump of calling her a pig because she gained, like, she went from 116 to 160 when she was Miss Universe and blah, 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 blah. Okay, so now this woman is all over TV. Every, every talk show in America wants her to trash Donald Trump and what, it, what a horrible man he is and how dare he say these things to me. Um, of course, they're finding some holes in the story. Uh, Megyn Kelly pulled up a Washington Post story that she said before she was ever uh, Miss Universe, a year prior, she became bulimic. Uh, and she was accused by a judge in Venezuela of threatening him and of driving her boyfriend away from a murder scene. But that aside... Um, how does Hillary, what, what possessed Hillary to go here, to go there, when it's one thing to say things about women, but you got a whole bunch of women who are willing to come forward and say, Bill Clinton did this to me, and then Hillary threatened me, and or Hillary trashed me, and Hillary ruined my life. So how, why would she go there? Well, Hillary doesn't call me for advice, so it's hard for me to understand, <laughs> but... I will say, Steve, that I hope both candidates in the next 40 days will start talking about the issues. And frankly, I think Hillary beats uh, Donald Trump on the issues, and that's what people want to hear about. The, the economy is kind of stagnant, and we want to know how we're going to fix the economy. We want to know how we're going to pay off the deficit, and we want to know how we're going to keep uh, ourselves and the world safe. And I wish we would talk about those issues and get away from name calling. But that's, like I said, nobody's calling me. Well, well okay, but, but, if, but if Hillary had called you and said, should I go there and open up this Pandora's box and allow Trump, who did say at the debate, I could say some things about your family, but I'm not, he might yet, he didn't then, would you, if, if she said, Webb, should I, do, should I bring this up? Should I put this woman out there? What would you have said to her? I would have said, you win on the issues, so stick to the issues. So, no, you would have said, don't do it. Uh, that's what I would have said, but like I said, they don't call me. <laughs> <laughs>